Talking about someone whose passion is cooking for others, I'll say it's my aunt. She is the eldest of my grandparents' children, so she had been in charge of caring for her younger siblings ever since she was young. And then later, she also took care of her children and grandchild. All my mother's siblings live close to one another, probably to give and receive support from each other. So even as a young girl, I would often frequent my aunt's house for daily meals especially when my house was under renovation. As my grandmother was from the north and my aunt learned cooking from her, most of her dishes were somewhat northern inspired. Some of her most iconic dishes include chicken pho, grilled meat on skewers, eaten with rice noodles and pickled vegetables, and duck and fermented tofu hot pot. However, she doesn't limit herself to dishes originated from the north as she has also mastered central and certain dishes such as bumbo and shrimp braised in coconut water. As far as her cooking studies are concerned, I believe she mostly learned how to cook from observing my grandmother, who was a housewife. But I think she also took inspiration from my grandfather's side of the family, who hailed from the Mekong Delta region. In recent years, she also learned from her children, who introduced her to Western dishes like pizza and spaghetti. So you could say she took bits and pieces from other cooks she've met throughout her life. In my opinion, my aunt's love for cooking for others stems from her role in the family as the eldest child. In preparing meals for her younger siblings, she may have found a sense of purpose and fulfillment. Another source, I think, is her love for her family. I've seen her meticulously select the best cuts of meat and the freshest vegetables just so that her family gets the highest quality of food. Her passion for cooking has been passed down to her children and also me. Although my cooking skills are nowhere near as adept as hers, I'm still trying my best to replicate her recipes and in doing so, immortalize her legacy. <laughs>